one guys in this video i would like to entertain you with some vector addition and uh, vector addition in linear algebra so let's see the questions right here so vector addition in linear algebra so the first question is asking x value is given it's 1 3 5 and y vector so all of them are unit vectors uh, y has given 0 3 7 and they are asking find the x x magnitude and y magnitude so to find this x magnitude we have to use this formula x magnitude is equal to square root of x1 square plus x2 square plus x3 square whatever the value x carries so in this case it carries 1 3 5 so I'm going to just square it 1 square plus 3 square plus 5 square which is going to give me 1 square 1 3 square 9 5 square 25 25 plus 9 is going to be 34 34 plus 1 is 35 root 35 that is my x magnitude and y magnitude same thing it's going to be y1 square y2 square y3 y3 square and i'm going to write it like here right here so y1 square is 0 0 square 0 and plus 3 square plus 7 square which is equal to 3 square is 9 and 7 square is 49 49 plus 9 is 58 root 58 is answer root 58 is answer so the second question is asking what is the x dot y so the formula for the x dot y is as you see above there are two formula x dot y can be equal to x magnitude y magnitude cos theta or x dot y can be equal to x1 y1 plus x2 y2 plus xn uh, whatever the y x y values so we have to use one of these formula the problem with the first formula is to find the answer from the first formula we need the angle in this case they haven't provided any angle therefore we have to do the second equation so second equation says what x uh, dot y is equal to uh, x1 y1 x2 y2 and x3 y3 right so x1 mean 1 times 0 1 times 0 plus uh, 3 times 3 plus uh, 5 times 7 so 1 times 0 is 0 3 times 3 9 7 times 5 35 35 plus 9 is going to be 35 plus 9 is going to be 44 that's our answer so since we are done with this question I'm going moving to the next one moving to the next one uh, if x and y are unit vectors x dot y is equal to 3 uh, find 2x plus 3y so 2x plus 3 they are asking you to find 2x plus 3y magnitude all together magnitude so first of all I have to explain something before I do this question so there is a there is a correlation between x and root x dot x so for example if x dot x what is the value it's gonna be uh, x dot x mean x magnitude like same thing x dot x mean uh, we have to multiply x1 x1 x2 plus uh, x, x dot x okay uh, I saw the components yeah. uh, 
x dot okay x dot x is going to be x the x1 x1 x2 x2 and x3 x3 so it's it multiply by itself x1 x1 x2 x2 plus x3 x3 so if you find the uh, and uh, the all together it's going to be uh, if you square it x dot x is going to be x dot x is going to be equal to whatever the value here it's so x1 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 square plus x2 square plus x3 square so what is the maximum magnitude of x it's going to be same thing x1 square x2 square plus x3 square so since both are same thing we can say both are equal so x magnitude is equal to root of x dot x therefore uh, we prove this one so I'm going to use this proof to find the solution for this question so they, they, they have given 2x plus 3 by magnitude uh, so let's consider it as an x to expand this let's say if it is x uh, like if it's x it's dot a it's gonna be uh, whatever it's uh, root of uh, it's dot it is similar right so 2x plus 3y dot 2x 3y so, so I'm going to multiply this uh, both um, so x x1 x1 2x times 2x is going to be 4x square 4x square and uh, for uh, for x square instead of I'm instead of writing x square I'm gonna write x dot x four x dot x four x dot x and then two x times uh, two x times uh, three y is gonna be what six six x dot y plus six x dot y and uh, plus 3y times uh, 3y times 2x is gonna be 6y dot x and uh, uh, th 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 2 3y times 3y is gonna be 9y dot y since it's a unit vector there's a thing in the unit vector that whatever the unit vector dot by itself is equal to 1 So that's what we have to remember. X dot x is going to be one, and uh, since uh, it's like that, I'm going to multiply four by one, and x dot y they have provided in the question is going to be equal to three. So I'm going to apply this this one to this one. So six times one, uh, so uh, it's uh, it's three. Six times three plus six times three um, plus uh, nine. Y times one because y dot y is equal to one, right? So since we have found this one here, it's going to be four plus six times three is going to be eighteen plus eighteen plus nine is going to be uh, eighteen plus nine is going to be twenty seven. Twenty seven going to be plus eighteen is going to be um, thirty five. Thirty five plus ten is going to be forty five. Forty five plus four is going to be forty nine. Root forty nine is seven. Therefore, our answer is 7. So, I hope you guys really enjoyed this one and had one right here. Uh, see you next time.